So here we go, MPWF fan base. It is time for the MPWF Undisputed Tag Team Championship matchup. And by this ovation, you know who's making his way to the ring. Making his way to the ring is Antonio Goldman. For months, the cabinet have ruled the entire MPWF. For months, they have cost superstars shots at championships. They have screwed superstars over. One of them being the first ever undisputed champion in MPWF history, Antonio Goldman. Tonight, Antonio Goldman gets retribution on the grandest stage of them all against the tag team champions. The tag team champions have helped many a time to screw Antonio Goldman over. Like we said, tonight is a night the people are trying to make the cabinet pay. So far, Brie Bella has retained her championship. Can Goldman and his partner Apollo tonight defeat the natural disasters and stop the cabinet from raiding over the MPWF? And another thunderous ovation here tonight by our MPWF fan base here in Madison Square Garden. And ladies and gentlemen, there is the protector of the MPWF, Apollo. See, Apollo was not even supposed to be here tonight. Apollo was supposed to be suspended indefinitely until WrestleMania, until the MPWF chairman came and rectified things the way they used to be in the MPWF. To a certain degree, that is. The cabinet still strong. Still screwing people like no other, especially this man Apollo. This man was screwed out of the Undisputed Championship Tournament, screwed out of a spot of the Royal Rumble. But tonight at WrestleMania, Apollo can win a championship that he's never won in his career, and that's the MPWF Undisputed Tag Team titles. Tonight, Apollo and Antonio Goldman together look to protect the MPWF from the cabinet. But you people know as well as I do that this is going to be a difficult feat for Antonio Goldman and Apollo when they have to take on the natural disasters Whisper and Smoke. Whisper and Smoke, two of the most devastating, no, these two are the most devastating wrestlers in all of core wrestling. There's no, there's no fairy coding this. These two are the baddest sons of bitches in all of core wrestling and they dominate everyone they go up against in the ring. There is no tag team on the face of this earth who come even close to the natural disasters. And that is why I'm afraid for Antonio Goldman and Apollo. Yes, they may be former tag team champions, but they, sorry, former world champions, but they are not on the caliber at the tag team level of the natural disasters. And many people believe that Antonio Goldman and Apollo are gonna beat the hell out of these two. News flash, these guys are the natural disasters. These guys are the toughest tag team in call wrestling. This is gonna be one hell of a fight between these four men, ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen, uh, let's kick off this undisputed tag team championship match. And here we go, Antonio Goldman squaring up with Whisper here, and Whisper in the face of Goldman, and Goldman not showing any intimidation whatsoever. And now Whisper there with a headlock, and I want a spinning wheel kick there by one half of the tag team champions. And for those of you that are watching MPW for the first time and decided to tune in to WrestleMania, you're going to see something you've never seen before in your life by these tag team champions, the, the natural disasters. And right now you're not seeing it is because Antonio Goldman's whipping their ass right now. But I mean, you're going to see the methodic double team by these two, which is just phenomenal to watch. I look at Antonio Goldman already. Antonio Goldman clearing house here tonight at WrestleMania, trying to stand up to these guys, not showing any fear whatsoever. Now Whisper running back, back into the ring. Another thing you're going to see from the natural disasters is the speed and strength. I have never in my life seen anyone the size of these men pull off the maneuvers they have done. I mean, imagine Whisper, the black guy in the white. Imagine him doing a shoot and star press off the turnbuckle. I know, not very believable, but you're about to see it. I bet you'll see it tonight at WrestleMania. And now Apollo calling on Smoke, tell him let's go. And here we go, a Colorado tie up here, Apollo roughly the same size as these two guys. Apollo is a huge man here, a former MPWF champion. And look at the strength of Apollo as he drives Smoke right back, spine first into the mat. And Apollo here with a gut, kick to the gut now. And Apollo Irish whipping Smoke. 
I'm saying Apollo wants to get back at these men so bad. These guys screwed Apollo so many times here. The cabinet has screwed Apollo so much here in the MPWF. And Apollo telling Smoke to get back up. And now he's twisting away at the wrist. But now Smoke now reversing here and pushing Apollo away. And now Smoke here heads to the takedown there. And that's the speed we were talking about of the tag team champions. And now Smoke, Irish Rip now sending Apollo into the turnbuckle here. And now what is this? Smoke now telling Apollo to come back. Apollo rushing in here. And now what a hurricane runner there by Smoke. What athleticism there by one half of the tag team champions. Said it's a, it's a shock to see men this size pull off maneuvers like that. And uh, Apollo is going to have to treat these two like cruiserweights. He's going to have to ground them and stop them from pulling off the moves that we've seen them pull in the past. Apollo now sizing up, watching his opponent here. Not afraid of smoke. Now throwing him into the turnbuckle here. And now he tags in Antonio Goldman. And now watch this here. The double team by the challengers and want to boot there by Goldman. And now Goldman picking smoke back up. And I want to punch there by Antonio Goldman. Look at these fists here. And I'll spit punch right in the jaw of smoke. And I'll Irish whip now. And he said, conventionally in tag team matches, you are supposed to keep your opponent on your side of the ring. Like I said, Antonio Goldman is trying to show no fear in this matchup. Hence, why he's taking them out on their side of the ring. And it backfired here. And smoke fights back with the head scissors. So what a night we've seen here tonight at WrestleMania, ladies and gentlemen. And I'll smoke off the top rope with an elbow drop on Antonio Goldman with belly connecting. I mean, Brie Bella defended her championship in a triple threat, a three-way dance match against Michelle McCool and Sasha Fierce. And I said, if you have not checked out the closing parts of that matchup, why the hell are you here right now? Go back, check out the closing parts of that matchup, check out the rest of WrestleMania. It's been an unreal show. And don't forget to check out what's coming in WrestleMania. Still to come tonight, we got the Undisputed Championship matchup as the Royal Rumble winner, Craig David, takes on cabinet member Yamasaki Yoshino. Vern Mongo fights for his life against MVP in a street fight. You got a match made in hell and Angel Blade against Systematic Carnage and Hell in a Cell, Jason Rage versus Helios Christ, nine years in the making. So much action still to come, so much action right now on a net breaker take down there by Whisper. And uh, Whisper looking to tag back in his partner again, I know slice the outside of the ring, perhaps trying to fake out Antonio Goldman caught him in a waist lock and now dragging him towards his half of the ring and this is what we were talking about before the great methodic tag team moves here by these two and oh what a drop kick there by smoke these guys work well together these guys have been nothing else other than tag team partners these guys have never been singles competitors all they've done since they came to wrestling was ta be tag together and hence that's why they're the undisputed tag team champions right now and they are really taking Antonio Coleman and Apollo out of their element in this matchup and now here what a total world backbreaker there by Smoke you see Smoke is proud of his smoke self sorry Smoke is in control of this contest Apollo trying to get Antonio Coleman on uh, ready to go back in this matchup if that made sense sorry trying to get the fans on Goldman's side that made more sense and now Smoke now with a spinning wheel kick taking down Antonio Goldman and now Smoke here got him set up and here comes the three suplexes here ladies and gentlemen watch as Smoke here pops these hips how beautiful as these maneuvers here by Smoke and here's the last one and he drives Antonio Gorman to the mat and now tagging in his tag team partner and these guys are looking to finish Antonio Gorman here and I whisper off the top row shoot it's so pressing oh my god Antonio Gorman got the knees up Antonio Gorman may have saved his career here and look at this look at the smarts of the tag team champions Smoke took down Apollo so Antonio Gorman when he had the opportunity to cannot make the tag to his partner and now they are back in control of this tag team matchup once more and said Sp Whisper is super proud of his actions and now here we go here. And I whisper now, what's this? Oh! Ooh! Bout breaker, net breaker combination there by Sm Whisper, sorry. And now we're driving the knee right into Antonio Gorman's head. And I whisper looking to try and take a cheap shot at Apollo. And this time, he's just torn in the face of Apollo. Bad mouthing him, smack talking. And I want to kick to the gut there by Whisper. And I whisper now, Irish whip. Antonio Gorman in trouble here in Hurricane Runner there. What a move there by one half of the tag team champions. And now Whisper heading to the top rope. Looking for something big here. 450 splash. 450 splash off the top rope by a three to 400 pound man. And that could have broken the ribs of the challenger, Antonio Gorman. And I'm surprised that I thought Whisper would go for the cover. Antonio Gorman now trying to fight back here. Antonio Gorman. He looking at the fatigue in Gorman here. And he sets up a suplex. 
Suplex by Antonio Goldman. Antonio Goldman needs to make the tag to Apollo. Can he get it? Yes! And he tags in the protector. And the protector taking down Whisper. And now Apollo trying to take out Smoke. And now misses. And Smoke hanging Apollo up in the ropes. And again, the speed comes into play for the tag team champions. And now tagging back in Smoke here. And now Smoke now got it. Apollo in a headlock, but Apollo fights back. Knocks away at the wrist, and an SEO takeover there by Apollo. And now Apollo there with a clothesline taking over Whisper. And now the strength is coming into play here by Apollo. And, oh, what a boot there by Apollo. People might be surprised that Apollo was that flexible to get his feet that high in the air. And now Apollo trying to fight back with a spear there, and drives his shoulders into the gut of Smoke. And now a knee to the face, and Apollo is starting to feel the momentum in this matchup. And now Apollo, now with a waist sock, now twisting away at the wrist. And now Apollo twisting away at the wrist again. And I said the only thing that's on Apollo's mind is revenge. Revenge is the only thing he can think about in this matchup. And that's what he wants to get. And how big would the revenge be if he wins the tag team championships from the natural disasters. And now Apollo now fights back on the elbow to the face there. Apollo now running back into the ropes. Apollo now the STO takeover there on Smoke. Smoke is in trouble, ladies and gentlemen. He needs to make the tag to Whisper if he expects his team to survive in this matchup. And a spine buster takedown there by Apollo. Way better than David Otonga could ever do it. And now kicks him in the gut. Apollo now bouncing off the ropes here. Smoke now trying to reverse it. But Apollo catches him back with a headlock. Irish whip again. And no, what a shoulder block. And now he takes out both the members of the Natural Disasters. And Apollo is starting to feel it. And this Madison Square Garden crowd is starting to feel it as well. And you can see they're trying to trying to recuperate, trying to talk game team game talk, trying to talk game plan here on a drop kick there by Smoke. And now Smoke on doing the turnbuckle here, looking to do damage here. And oh wait, Apollo quickly catches him in the headlock. Apollo now throws him into the unprotected turnbuckle, spear to the gut, and the backfired. And now look at him driving the knee into Smoke again. And Whisper trying to smack talk Apollo. Trying to keep him off of his game here. But nothing can destroy the focus of the protector. And now Apollo here. What's this here? Snap man. And oh my god, what a kick to the face. My goodness gracious me. Almost knocked all the teeth out of Smoke's mouth. And ladies and gentlemen, the halls and that's in your fall. And there was a sit down power bomb there by Apollo. Going for the cover. Do we have new tag chance? One, two, Three, and we have new undisputed tag team champions. Let's go! Let's go! What a tag team matchup here tonight at WrestleMania, ladies and gentlemen. And we'd like to take you this time to tell you that our replays are brought to you by SmackDown vs. Raw 2011. This is your moment, and by Top Spin. This is sponsored by XSN Sports. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been a great show. And like you can see by the replays, this was a smash mouth tag team matchup. Nothing but big impact here. And watch this boot by Apollo. Just driving his feet right in the face of smoke here. And like I said before, the halls of Athens show fall as Apollo drives the sit down power bomb. Apollo drives his opponent to the mat. And now Apollo and Antonio Goldman have become the new tag team champions. A great contest between these two ladies and gentlemen. And if you thought that this was getting to the closing moments of WrestleMania, WrestleMania is only heating up, ladies and gentlemen. WrestleMania is only getting better.